Warning, do not shoot these rounds in unfit conditions. May cause fires. We are not held liable. Yeah, it'll be fine. One thing I miss about winter already is there's no flies in winter. I hate flies. They're the most annoying thing ever. But what's not annoying kind of is. It's a 50 BMG, so hats off to Denver Bullets, man. They got their own boxes now, which is awesome. And so these are incendiaries. These are actually, they're new. These are M1 military grade incendiary rounds. They're pretty cool. I actually had 150 of these blue tips. Uh, they're, they explode bigger than the regular incendiaries. Uh, you get, you get a lot of blue smoke of these things. They are awesome, man. So I got, I'm actually just doing like a little video for YouTube shorts because, you know, you get more views that way. And so if you see this video pop up with like blue tip, red tip, whatever, that's basically what I'm doing because YouTube shorts, you get, you know, a couple thousand views versus like a video where you take your time and do all this good stuff. You get less than a hundred views, but I don't really care too much about that because I'm just having fun today. I have my steel plate, my one inch plate up there. And then I got an old uh, battery out of my goo <laughs> snack. And yeah, it's pissing me off. So fuck you, you die today. And I'm just going to get set up and just have some fun, man. Try out these new uh, incendiary rounds. And I think the other ones are great tips I got too. I love Denver Bullet. Guys need to check them out. If They have other ammo too tell you what their prices you can't beat them man a lot of them are reloads but like these are new and i think it was 50 dollars for a box of 10 for incendiary rounds that's pretty good and these were gray tip they're reloads 24 dollars is it 24 34 man i want to say it was 24 it was cheap but talk is cheap and was expensive who says that all the time <laughs> another gun tuber but let's get set up Okay, yeah, hopefully you guys can see the flash because the camera doesn't always do the best job of picking it up. They really exploded pretty good. Anyway, first I just want to try an Amax at the steel just to kind of see what it does. Okay. Amax. <laughs> I could hear stuff flying through the woods with it. Okay, I also put out an angle because I figured with the Amax anyway, it would, and it did. It, I heard it like fly and haul an ass through the woods there. So, safety first. Yeah, but they're just aluminum. They have like a, just a lead core. They have an aluminum tip with a lead core and a copper jacket. So, we'll try it on a battery. The battery, it should really devastate it. So, let's try the other ones here. Okay, next up, we got the blue tip. I put that on more of an angle because it actually ripped part of the top of it off there. So, Okay, blue tip. Oh, oh yeah. That was a good flash on that one. All right, as you can see, it just, I mean, it just scratched it. They're not, not meant for penetrating. Kind of meant just to fuck shit up. And that's what it did. Okay, next up we got a gray tip. This is armor piercing incendiary. And this should dig a hole in it. Okay, gray tip. Okay, that's kind of surprising there because I have it on a pretty steep angle. And it de <laughs> deviated there. <laughs> If he's not the world's worst stutterer, then 27-year-old Eric May comes close. Every new syllable could set off a stuttering spasm. Negative <laughs> part. These were the old like APs, so maybe I'll try to take a little bit of angle out and I'll hit it with the A pit round. Okay, before we get to the A pit round. Just gonna do a black one. This is just an AP round. Okay. 
Okay, black tip. Yeah, it must just because of the angle I have that plate. Because <laughs> normally they do. You can tell I dug in and shot out there because that's a AP round right there, the old one. So they do, but I just, I don't know, man. I, my, the way my luck's been lately, I'm just playing it safe. So we'll put the A-pit in now. Okay, so now we got the red and silver tip A-pit round. And let's see what it can do. I'll try to aim a little bit higher. Okay, there's maybe a good shot of the penetrator from the last time I shot it. Ooh, they about the same. So it just deviated out it. Like I said, if you'd hit it hit straight on, it'd penetrate, but say when the, the, the luck I've been having lately, I'm good. You know? So I'll set the battery up and we'll shoot it some. All right, so I'm going to leave you guys up here and put the camera in slow-mo. I think the first round I hit it with is uh, an incendiary round. And then if it's still there, I'll try an Amax or something. Well, dang, man, that's what that's what incendiary rounds do to the battery. Jeez, man, I'm glad I moved my phone back. Cause it's still, got, I was back there and shit came running, flying back. I mean, look at this crap. It annihilated that thing. Like, there's part of it. Other parts over there. I mean, <laughs> that's what you want in incendiary. I was gonna move my steel so it didn't get covered in battery acid, but there's battery acid everywhere. I got it off my phone as quick as I could. So hopefully just my shirt and stuff got ruined. But my God. That's what incendiary rounds are for. Mm-hmm.